I started drawing out of boredom also. Um, I mean, I've been reading comics my whole life. I got addicted to superhero stuff when I was like 10. Um, and so I've always kind of scribbled on notebooks and things. Um, I'm a grad student now in neuroscience, and so I was in a very boring class one day. And I started scribbling things, and I drew one where this guy's head was melting, and he's like, ah, my mind is dying. And then I just drew a fish because I like animals, and I didn't know how to draw a fish body, so I drew human clothes <laughs> on it. Um, and then I just had it started start saying things like Dilbert would say, and then it kind of spun out of that. I, I thought I started thinking like, what did these animals do in their human clothes? So they probably right. worked in an office. Um, and then I remembered that quote: "If you judge a fish by its ability to climb a tree." then it'll live its whole life thinking it's stupid. So I, I had this idea for a company that animals will call in and ask advice on how to climb trees, and then they hire people to give them advice, but then they hire people based, hire animals, irrelevant of what they are, so they hire a fish to teach how to climb a tree, and then he just struggles and does his best to do it, but fails. Um, so then I, I spent that whole class drawing, and I didn't learn anything about statistics. Um, <laughs> All right. And How I, old were you? Huh? How old were you? Oh, this was fairly recent. I'm. This was last year, I think, and I'm 30 now. All right. Um, so I started drawing everything on paper. I have a lot of them over there, and then I got an iPad, and I started drawing on this to simplify it, and started posting it on Instagram so I could pretend I'm popular. All right. Is it just me, or you have a picture of John behind you? That's actually a painting of me. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm glad you noticed because I hung it up just as the joke. I think he's saying we're. I, I, think, I think he's saying we might be long lost relatives and just not know. <laughs> I mean, you, you put glasses on him. That's actually John. <laughs> like... No, my girlfriend is an artist, and so I draw comics, and she acts like I'm good at it, and then she paints realistic paintings of me. She's pretty good. She's definitely pretty good. I'm really into art, and she's pretty good. Well, you should buy your stuff then. How much is it? I don't know. You have to ask her. I can give all you right, a website. All right, all right. That sounds cool. I have a thing for portraits. Uh, what about you, Jacob? Oh, yeah. It's you're, my turn. You're super young. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All right. So, Last but not least. two years ago, approximately. Uh, all right. I, just, I was just bored this summer vacation I just and all came out from I, like, boring I just, right? <laughs> you get boring joke yeah. comics <laughs> yeah I, I was just like i had this joke and i wanted to tell people uh i first wanted to like do animation but animation takes a lot of time and effort yeah. uh, and i was just like hmm what about just doing three panels and yeah that's kind of how i started and i thought it was fun so i continued the whole summer making comics yeah and yeah, well, I mean, you, you made how many? Uh, oh, that summer, I think I made maybe 15 or something. Okay. Yeah. That's not, that's not bad. That's not <laughs> bad. Yeah, it was just, I remember there was one week I made one comic a day, I think. Yeah, that was last. Wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was just like having so much fun. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you. I, I really like, like your, your joy style. It seems like. You've been doing two years and like so like mm. uh, kind of modern if I you know if you understand what I'm saying. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I think I, I really like appreciate it. The simplistic way of doing things. All right. Mm. That's pretty cool. And so my second question is actually, who are your favorite artists? I mean, you got you got your inspiration from being bored, and we got that. Yeah, but, kind of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I also, I'm also sure you got your inspiration from other artists, yeah, like yeah. other comic artists. Yeah, because so. when I was, when I started making comics, I kind of started looking at more and more comics. And All right. Yeah, my, I have the books right here. My two favorite oh, yeah? cool. cartoonists are Safe and Endangered and Eat My Paint. Oh, oh Eat My Paint? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Really we got him the last podcast. Yeah, I know. I, I watched that. It was really cool. <laughs> Sick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember you on the chat. Mm. So uh, you said Eat My Paint and the other one? Sorry. Didn't hear it? Uh, yeah, yeah. Eat the My second... Paint and uh, Safely Endangered. Oh, okay, 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 yeah. okay. I know. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of famous here. Yeah, it's kind of famous too. He's very famous. Yeah. And uh, what about you, Dick? Um, is like in general or like current web comic artists? Well, I mean, all of both of them. I, I'm actually interested. All right. Um, I wanna hear both. I remember looking at things like Calvin and Hobbes before I could even read, just because I like pictures. It. And I think just about every I cartoonist in the world has that in common. Yep. Um, and then, you know, like I was saying earlier, superhero comics are huge for me, and so. Like, I sent you a couple pictures of Flex Mentallo. I think that pretty much sums up my taste in that. There's something about that whole genre where they can take something very silly. Like, Flex started as an advertisement in 1960s comic books. And then they made one of the most beautiful pieces of art I've ever seen out of it. They had this silly premise, but they took it seriously. And so that's that's something that I think a lot about. And then, as far as more recent webcomic artists, I think... One of the major reasons why I started doing this was um, I was looking at Extra Fabulous comics. And, and he uh, does all, right. all the things in pencil and pen. And I just realized how easy it would be to do, um, maybe not make quality work, but just to make work at all and, and post yeah. it. So that was a big inspiration for me. And then I just I love people like Chris Simpson's artist because he's just clearly insane. Yeah, I mean... You're actually so right because last time, for example, we had the Opie Doodle. It's like I really love this this artist. Like his sense of humor is amazing, but like his drawing style is not so elaborate. You don't need to. I mean, there's Ren that has a super drawing style, but sometimes you just don't need that. You, you there's many things that come into right. it, like sense of humor, drawing style. You just have to mix them up. Mm-hmm. And, and quality work and comes from all of them. And it doesn't really you know? matter if it's something that's considered traditionally quality or not. You just need to be yeah. able to communicate an idea enough mm. to get a joke across. And yep. like I, I don't have any training in art. I've never really done it seriously <laughs> until I started drawing yeah, this yeah, shitty yeah. fish. <laughs> and I hope it translates. It's funny to me. Uh, I really like the the thing of the fish that climbs the trees. Now now I understand a lot more your comic. Yeah, like when you I that. haven't figured out Literally. the right way to get it across yet but i mean it's it's a project nice we are working to make it and what about you john so i i guess uh when i was first starting this out starting out doing comics uh one of my friends uh, that i'd known kind of on twitter for a while she has a comic called uh kid commander that she's been doing forever and she's been really really helpful right. uh, uh girl by the name of aria bell um and her art style is just something i think is you know i really enjoy that's something I, I try to emulate as best I can, um, just because there's there's so much of it that I like. But you know, in terms of like other artists, uh, Hot Paper Comics is one of the ones I'm always reading whenever it pops on my feeds. Oh, oh, uh, I love it. I love Martin Sorcer. Thirty Two, um, big fan of that. <laughs> um, he's super young. Like he just came out of nowhere like last yeah, year. Yeah, and I think he's I think he's still in college. Like you know, in his I mean. At least I, I, I yeah. hear that he's in college anyway. I don't. I think he's about my age, yeah. I don't even want to ask how old you are, because it's just going to make me feel old. <laughs> <laughs> me? I mean, there's, there's Jacob here. I don't want to ask it too. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm, six, I'm 16 years. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> I, I'm 36, so... You know, yeah, all right. I feel right now. Pardon my language. <laughs> No man, no worry. Like you're not old, thirty six. I'll tell you what. I wish I'd started this a lot sooner. I started this when I was thirty two, right. and with the amount of fun I've had, much much like Dick, I you know no formal training at all, just kind of went with it, and you know I've had so much fun with it that I I wish I'd started this earlier in my life, hands down. I mean, yeah, you know, it's, you don't get the inspiration. Like you just get it sometimes, yep. and that's that's how it is. I think I think I don't remember which artist it was. Oh, actually, it was Van Gogh. If I'm not if I'm not wrong, I may say something very bad, but I think he started very late. I think he started at like 19. Yeah. And now you cannot buy one. <laughs> like you don't have the money. <laughs> you don't. Well, there's no uh, there's like, no bad time to start. I I believe. That. Yeah, exactly. Like, and I mean to tell you about the young thing by by, uh, Fatmate, She's 34 and she she's kind of older than me and she parties way more than me so like a- age is not an issue trust me <laughs> age is definitely not an issue yeah art is for everyone absolutely yeah 100 mm. percent. yeah so all right so this is like the big question it's not related with comics but it's something like very related 
like with comic artists mm-hmm. like i know all of you had will have something to do about it what about video games guys <laughs> oh yeah i want to listen to some <laughs> i'm gonna start with you jacob uh what video games i play yeah yeah tell me some. Uh, i have a switch and uh, my favorite game is without a doubt uh, breath of the wild it's really really good uh is what uh breath of the wild legend of zelda all right. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. I heard of it. It's okay. really good. Never played it. Um, what is it about? I never played it. Oh, like, <laughs> I'm a newbie. I'm a newbie yeah. in that game. <laughs> yeah, I know Nick, right? From Legend of Zelda. Uh, yeah, yeah. I kind of know the yeah, guy. Yeah. It, 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 <laughs> I heard we go yes. way back. It, it, it was. It was. A, uh, it was the best game of 2018. It was. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Sure looked it. Hmm. You're in high school, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, because I used to play a lot in high school. Well, I used to get crazy with FIFA. I don't, I don't know if you, if you guys play like, it's like a football game. I used to play a lot. And like Call of Duty, do you guys play it? Uh, not that mm, one specifically. I haven't specifically, played it that no. much. Uh, All right. Uh, okay. I, I just, I just shut up and let you talk, <laughs> okay, John. Because oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I said two games, nobody plays. No, I, I was actually picking the Team Fortress Two for a long time. I mean, that's oh, probably a bold right. games yeah. I've ever played. I probably sunk the most hours into that. Um, but you know, it's, it's Fortress Two. You said Fortress Two. Okay. Um, but honestly, like these days, I don't get to play much video games. Uh, you know, I'm drawing my comic. I'm doing a day job, and I've got a one-year-old daughter that um, obviously I want to spend yeah, as much that's... time as I can with. Um, and that's pretty a lot of time to spend. Yeah. Like. Hey, but you know what? Honestly, weirdly enough, how I get my video game fixed these days is I'm just watching Twitch. Um, you know, if there's games, if there's games I want to, this is great. You can put it on the background. You can pick it up. You can put it down. You don't have to devote like an, an hour or two to play. It's just, it's just there. So it's fantastic for me, at least. Yeah, there are people playing all day long. Absolutely. Actually. Yeah, like game crews. You... They're really good. Oh yeah. Yeah. Would you like to watch Twitch? Uh, so the big one I'm watching right now, there's a guy by the name of Dolphin Chemist, um, and he plays a lot of the slower <laughs> games. I don't know. <laughs> Somebody's Dolphin like, Chemist. Yeah, that's, that's that sounds like a, one of my characters. It's... <laughs> <laughs> well, he, you have a dolphin, don't you? So he plays like Slay the Spire, FTL, and those kind of games. Uh, I was big into Slay, Slay the Spire, um, but the, I think the reason I really like him, he, one, he's entertaining, but two, he also he takes it at this pace that like allows me to. I don't even need necessarily to watch him play to understand what's going on. He kind of explains what's going on. You know, it's not action packed. Uh, he just kind of All right. he takes the time to really engage with with this chat. It's just a lot of fun. So I find myself honestly going to sleep with just the audio on and like an earbud in my ear and just listening to it. <laughs> so is is like a good entertainer? Isn't I it? think so. A she he I don't know he, if it's he, he's a man. Like, you, okay, you know, okay, I he's heavy with the Simpsons references, which I appreciate. So I mean, that's <laughs> me. <laughs> Actually, I've noticed something about Twitch that, like, it's, it's not cool to say, but, like, when I when I used to play video games when I was to be in high school, like, six, seven years ago, like, with your friends, when you used to say video games, it was supposed to be a man thing, right? Like, men play video games, girls do other stuff. Mm-hmm. When That was when I was in high school, right? But like, right now, I see, like, kind of a lot of girls playing video games. I really, really like it. Like... When I was that age, my dream was to like be with a girl that used to play FIFA. Like <laughs> seriously, <laughs> they they've always been there. You're just seeing them now for the first time. Mm-hmm. She man, I sometimes I hang it out with too many guys. I guess. <laughs> I I didn't know girl that played FIFA that time. What about you, Dick? Um, what you play? I am gonna be the odd person out. I've never been big into video games. But I play a lot of Magic, if you're familiar with that. Ah, yes. Yeah. I played it with a friend, and I had so much fun doing yeah, it. Yeah, I got heavily into that a few years back, and so I, I watch a lot of that on Twitch, and I play it when I can. Um, they just came out with Arena, which so you can play it online All right. without having to spend a oh, lot of money, a... and I, I, I play a lot of that, yeah. All right. I, I, is it, I remember that, like... There's earth, forest, fire. Am I correct? Yeah, water, and, and then like m- uh, mana points. Black. What? Yeah, and you get like magic points to do your spells. Yeah. So the more yeah, you, you play lands, group. you get they call it mana out of that, and then you use that to play spells. Yeah, mana exactly. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. It's a great game. Love it a lot. And then uh, I don't know. I'm just such a nerd that I spend most of my time studying the cards rather than actually playing the game. <laughs> You know something? I was, I was hanging. We are in Paris, so I was hanging around the city, 
and I I found a shop. Like there there are some around the city. You mm-hmm. just find them. If it's me, I just find them. Don't look for them. But I I found this shop where they play like um, you know Warhammer forty thousand. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I I really love that stuff. I used to play a lot a game called War War Warhammer Down of War. It was like the digital version of it. Okay. I've heard of and it. Yeah. I had. I had so much fun doing it. Like, I remember one day I played like seven hours, and my parents came home and said <laughs> <laughs> they checked on the computer how much I played it. They said you played too much, kid. <laughs> nice. I had to think that sometimes block my computer. <laughs> so like, it was so much fun. Shit. So all right. So you you play different games actually. Last time I, I saw. You know, they, they they played so many things that the same, like so many games like were the same for for the artists last time. Mm. Well, it's weird. What what was it? What what the biggest game in Norway? Which are uh, the biggest game in Norway? Yeah, like the games that goes the most. Like in Italy, it's like Fortnite. Yeah. Is it, is it legal? I, I, I think it's kind of the same. Uh, well, yeah, there's a lot of players that. Yeah, there's a lot of people that play League of Legends. I haven't really gotten right. into it, but I've tried it. It was really hectic. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm 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 sorry for my ignorance. League of Legends is a game with like kind of fantasy game, isn't it? Like mm. you the MOBA. You go Okay, but like you don't have an army, don't you? You just yourself. Yeah. You just one character. I mean Yeah, on, uh, a, on how... a team of five against another team of five. Okay, and is are there like big maps? Yeah. Yeah. It's... And how does? Sorry. No, I want to know how does it work because I never really understood that. So basically, it's like five on five. There are objectives that you can kind of get, and the whole idea is the basic. The, at the end of the day, you're trying to kill the other person's base, the other team's base, and you've got to work okay. together and combine, you know, different characters so like with different work. abilities to, to to provide different synergies to give you an advantage to actually be able. Yeah, to yeah, do yeah. That. Oh. And how do you pick your like allies? Uh, I, they have a Random? matchmaking system that uh, you know gives you gives you partners, and I it's it's usually a point of frustration that you know you match with some people that necessarily don't play nice with others. So, <laughs> oh yeah, I know what you. They just go on their own and they just die and leave you hanging out to dry. Yeah, that's that's pretty that's typical basically. of most uh, uh, most <laughs> online games. Okay, because I I remember like. I don't know if you ever played, but Battlefield, I played a lot that game. No, and, never played Battlefield. Okay, it's like, uh, just to me, a better version of Call of Duty, a way better version. Like, on COD, you have like small small maps, you just go around and kill people, that's, that's the end of the game. You don't, you, you really, ne- you usually play with yourself, you just count yourself. But even if I didn't have the micro stuff, you see, you see yourself playing with other people, there's more interaction, you mm-hmm. know. And that's, and that's actually kind of pisses you off a lot when people don't don't play with you. That, you know what you mean? That's the one where like you can like pick up a, like a plane or a helicopter and just kind of start going around and like killing stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I know what you're talking. It about. was so dope. Like Battlefield Three to me is the best game ever. Like I, I literally <laughs> destroyed the game. I played so much in the high school. <laughs> <laughs> Love that game. I have been playing a lot of uh, Counter Strike Global Offensive though. That's really ah, good. Yeah. Love it's kind that of like Team my... Fortress, but yeah. Yeah, that was that was my college days. Like literally, we all played uh, Counter Strike One Six for yeah. just all night. That's such a good game. Absolutely. My colleagues, they get crazy for Counter Strike. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I haven't I haven't been playing video games a lot of time. So. Okay, so we we hang out, we talk about video games a lot. I want to ask you something else, all right? Mm-hmm. So well, let's say that, all right, we're comics. Okay, it's pretty weird evolution. I checked some time ago, and like the first web comic, I think it was in the end of the sixties, but I might be very wrong. But it was some time ago. On. Okay, first web comic was back in the sixties. Did they have the internet then? Time travel. Ah, mm. got it. no, they just. <laughs> <laughs> They just put the picture of an of a computer, I think. Or oh, I might be very wrong. Oh, okay. I got you. It was probably made in paint. You you've done a little <laughs> more research than yeah. you, so I trust you. No, 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 no. I might be very wrong. I'm, I might say very wrong things. I just it's been too much. Right? But my question is this one. So like, if you check even 
web comics 10 years ago right that's a huge difference right so you can tell that there's been an evolution in the drawing style in the humor like the super sh usually they're short like three or four cases and bum they're like you get the joke right straight mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. it's not a long story it's not like a, the old school comic where you have a book and you're like 30 40 pages so i'm asking you because you, you three are three artists so what do you think is gonna like do you have any ideas on how it might evolve in the future like technologically mm. and like uh even figuratively i think i do um all right i've noticed like reading comics when I was younger, when then people still read newspapers, it was generally like three panels. There was a setup, a twist, and then a punchline. And I've noticed that with Instagram, because you just have All that right. one square panel, people tend to break it up into four. And so I first noticed this with Extra Fabulous, where a lot of his comics are four panels instead of three. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's just because of the way that Instagram is set up. Sometimes you see comics where They'll force three panels and then they'll show them all at once. There'll be like one, one, and then one at the bottom with dead space around. Yeah. But to fill that space, people have been moving more toward like one panel or four panel comics. And so having seen that evolution, I think the way that comics are going to keep being set up is they're just going to evolve to fill whatever medium they're on. Instagram, I don't think is going to be around forever. So whatever comes up yeah. after that, it'll depend on the specific formatting of the website and comics will just evolve to fill that space. Um, which is actually something that I really like about the setup on Mandrill, is that it's, it's you're not confined to Thank that you. one square. You can add as much of it as you, as much as you want to it. Yeah, it's completely free, actually. Yep. It's just up to the artist. Yeah. Um, to give creation, like the, to the possibility to create whatever you want. Yeah. You just make it how you want. Yeah, that's actually so, so true. Like, like reflecting on it, like Instagram has been around for many years and it might be around, probably be around for some other years. But yeah, it's not going to be around forever. But right now, if you want to get famous as a webcomic artist, the first thing to do is like opening an Instagram mm -hmm. account, right? And make like, four panel I'm, comics, yeah. Yep. Exactly. Yeah. And, and actually talking about you, Jacob, like yeah. I wanted to tag you like on the, you're, you're the artist of the week, right? Yeah, right now yeah. you're the artist of the week. <laughs> so cheers to you. But like I, yes. we make the post on Twitter and Facebook. You don't have both of them. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't really use Twitter or Facebook. Uh, yeah, that's the thing. Yeah. That's mm. what I'm talking about. I've tried all of them. Um, Facebook didn't seem to get me any traction at all. Yeah, I'm not, Facebook um, is losing a lot. I'm not it's, a fan of Facebook for comics at all. It's grandparents, no. and that's about it. The problem with it is <laughs> you, have to, like, you have to buy ads on Facebook to get anywhere, and that's just yeah. the point. Yeah. Absolutely. And then, Twitter isn't set up for pictures at all, so that it, yeah. it works kind yeah. of for me, but it was a lot of work. And Instagram was just easy, and it just seemed to get the most traction there. Yeah. I know I, that was one of the things I only started by Instagram, like, this year. Or, I, I started it last year, but I only started taking it seriously, like, as a New Year's resolution, and the amount of traction on that versus any other platform is ridiculous. I will say one of the things to kind of circle back to your question on, like, where things are going um, I've noticed that there's this big trend towards like fewer words and more pictures and kind of showing, not telling. And that's definitely something I struggle with. I have a lot of dialogue in my comic and I feel like the ones mm. that have like, been able to convey the idea in just pictures kind of do way better than the ones that don't. Um, yeah. 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 There's like the Dane Man and Mike that make uh, mute comics. That's really yeah, yeah, the Damon, that's a good point, because I don't think he's ever used a single word in any of his comics, no, but they're no, all no. very, that's very true. understandable. Yeah. yeah, and political. I think Bunny Comics is <laughs> the same way, too. Bunny Comics, I don't think, uses any dialogue no, no, no. whatsoever. there's no words. Yeah. Uh, but there are, are symbols. They use symbols in the yep. kind of like dialogue in their speech bubbles. But no, that's like cool. the Sims. Yeah. yeah. Maybe that's, all right. maybe that's what we're doing. We'll all talk in emojis, in emojis in the future. Just it'll be comics oh, with yeah. emojis. No. <laughs> Keeping it 100, guys, you know? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. The Mammy period already passed. Like, I was end of my high school, and it was the Mammy. Mams, memes period? Do you call it meme in English? Yeah. Memes, yes. Yeah, in memes. Italian, it's Mammy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it was, it's done. It's over. There's going to be something else. I hope it's not going to come back, too. It probably will. Yeah, but the real is so true that so that Instagram right now and then whatever social network is gonna be that 
the next one. The webcomics are gonna adapt TikTok. to it. TikTok's the next one, guys. You think so? No, I, I think it's not at all. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you, because I'm not, I'm, I'm not convinced about like. <laughs> so, sorry, I'm... you took me seriously. That's my bad. <laughs> Yeah, but like, I I think I've seen it like some com I never use it and I don't plan to. But like I think it's for teenagers to just show off. Yeah, that's 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 uh, one platform right? I don't Sick. even understand. I'm too old. <laughs> we lost we lost Jacob. Sorry, we no. I just said to my colleague we lost Jacob again. Oh, did no. we lose him I'm or did we drive him he's away? Right, he's right there. He, no, he's like he's still. I you see sure? him moving. I'm, uh, oh oh oh! oh. <laughs> he's back. He's yeah. back here. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Okay, we got we got him back. I was just like All standing right. really really still. Okay, this yeah. time was scary. We, we lost you for the third time actually. Mm. <laughs> but no, is it me? I'm here, or I'm is here it for you? good. <laughs> but is it your connection or my connection? Because it might be ours. I'm pretty sure it's mine. My internet All right. connection isn't too strong. Is it like stormy there? Uh, well, there was rain for some minutes ago, and I. I uh, I can't see anything, it's all dark. Sure. Okay, so I actually, this actually is the time of the game. So we're gonna oh, play a game oh. called Pictionary. And Jacob, you know, he watched the previous podcast, so he knows about it. Yes, yes. So he, he has some advantages. Alright. Well, I've been practicing. Y'all are gonna fucking die. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, you just told me I was making noise with my pen. So I'm like, I'm leaving it here. I was playing with a pen while talking with you. And you just told me I don't have to. And they also gave me the word. So how are how are we gonna send them the word Instagram? Okay, so you do you prefer Discord or Skype to receive the word? I prefer Discord. My Discord? My phone right now is Skype, so to look at it, I probably have to. Oh yeah, sure. Yeah. You use Skype. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what about you, Dick and Jacob? Uh, well, we are kind of on Skype right now, but I can go over to Discord. No problem. Uh, yeah, yeah. So let's make it Discord. Is is that right for you, Dick? I'm not on the Discord. It would be easiest okay. if you just send it to me on Instagram, really. Oh, Instagram. So for Street Climbing Geek is Instagram. All right. For you, it's gonna be Instagram. So basically, the game is easy. So you, w each of you, one per turn, has to draw a picture. It's Pictionary. I don't know if you've ever played it. Mm -hmm. So one of you mm -hmm. has to draw a picture, and the other two has to guess. The first person that gets three guesses right wins the game. Um, with that, uh, it's going to be published like in all social networks tomorrow. No, sorry. Friday. It's, it's for the bright <laughs> lights, guys. Yes. <laughs> oh, damn. T tomorrow, we don't work here in France. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's holiday tomorrow. Is what? Yeah, it's. Uh, ah, even even in Norway, is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's like, it, it's the ascension, you know. When, mm, yeah, you know, yeah. I think this, the the second time Jesus Christ went up, like the last one, and like they they party here, mm. so we don't work. <laughs> we don't do that in Italy, though. What? Oh, sorry, I just. So, I have the words. Wait a second, sorry, wait a second. But yeah, they're, they're ready. Okay, so did you all access the second whiteboard? Yeah, yes. yeah I see it. Okay, so you all have the link, yeah, they're ready. So I have the words, actually. I have some, you can write me some, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can start with mine, then we can we go with yours. What? Well, okay, yeah, I have some, and then uh, we, we, we're gonna be okay. So, John, I, I start with okay, you. Okay, cool. So, Jacob and Dick, you have to guess now. Uh, so, well, uh, yeah. oh yeah, sorry. I was just going to shout it out. Yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> I, I did a mistake. Yeah, do you get it? Okay, so we're sending you the word. Uh, we're sending you the word right now. Okay, I see it. Do you get it? Okay, I got it. you can start. All right, so. I have the screen right there, so I'm watching that. So, huh, okay. Uh, let's go with this. It's a jackal. Is it a jackal? I think it's a jackal. It's jack a jackal. Jackal? Jackal. It's a jackal. Jackal? Yes. No. Uh, hair. It's a person with hair. It's a person with hair. Got it. First try. <laughs> Torso. Wait, this cord. 
It's a sleeve. It's a what? A sleeve. Sleeve. What's a sleeve? The seam on a shirt. And, ah, the sleeve. No. Oh, okay. And uh, long division. Oh no, wait. God, I suck at drawing. Seam. Is it a uh, seam? No. Come on, you're a web cartoon. <laughs> oh, I love the drawing. <laughs> I mean, I'm going somewhere with this, and I think Giorgio knows this, yeah, yeah, yeah. but, like, I'm not yeah. convinced. I, I know the, the, the answer, chair. of course I do. No, but that's close. No, yeah. Arm yeah, seats? That's, that's Torso chair. Yeah, that's into the, into the concept. Closer, that's closer. Uh, arm that's lean. It was the what? Arm uh, lean. Like, oh, okay, I, I, know, I know how I can do this. <laughs> I didn't know it existed. What is this? Hmm. Chair house. Hmm. That's two words. It's two words. I'm trying to get you to say the first word. Okay, it's two words. Okay. Two words. Lawn chair. Okay, I don't know if you... I, I'm going to give you a hint. Like, the only one I can give you not right now. is I don't know if you know Kendrick Lamar. He made a song with the, the answer in the... In the, in, in the word pool. In the title. No, 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 no. no. Yeah. Uh, it's three, three words. And the last, the last one is freestyle. But there are two words before. Cool. All, right. All right, I'm gonna go one other route with this. Hold on, let's make some let's make some room here. Uh, Armchair freestyle. No, but <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But the, the, the concept song. is close. Yes, that's my favorite song. <laughs> do this. Do this in red so it looks different. Okay. Uh... Wake up. But the second one is totally a chair. Headlights. Okay, the album the album is Good Kid, Man City. I can give it that. That's all and you people. cannot check on the internet. I don't know too many songs of Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, this is not super famous, this one. Seat. Car seat. Uh, Car seat, seat freestyle. Yeah. You, guys are, you guys are so freaking close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Chair, uh, recliner, couch. He got half car of it. He got half car, of it. Car, car couch. No, 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 no. <laughs> vehicle vehicle I mean, seat. Freestyle. We're gonna call it a draw, like let's <laughs> We're... okay. Last last time, let's try last one. And if you don't get it, like you just don't. Taxi seat. You know, you know why I named no. my comic alarmingly bad, right? I mean, this is just <laughs> uh, it's becoming apparent. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, that's this is the, honestly this is the best I got. I, okay, like I got... last chance, Dick. Hair chair. Nope. <laughs> Jacob, uh, <laughs> I like it. Okay. I give you half a point for that. Sick. Nailed it. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm not giving half a point. Right, that's, all, that's, all, that's all I got. Guys. I can't do it. Yeah, I, chair seat? Frank. No, it's back seat. Oh my that was a back. It, it was the back. And oh, the song is back seat back. freestyle. The back of the house. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you drew the back. Yeah. Ah. Okay. You drew the line Second word. The torso. I thought it was like the button line. Ah, uh, my bad. And I just got stuck in mode because I'm right. dumb. <laughs> okay, so we are sending the second word to Dick. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, sh I, I love the thing. I love the thing you're gonna draw. It's one of the things that fascinates fascinates me the most. Okay. Um. Let's see. Hopefully y'all follow the news. Oh, <laughs> oh, good. Like the cool news, not the sad news. Oh, okay. Pew news. Jackal. Jackal, it's a jackal. It's a jackal, you nailed it. It's a it. black hole. It's a black hole. Yay! Look at that hole. That, that was fast. That was fast. I'm an excellent artist. <laughs> and you're an excellent lawyer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you see the picture they took of it? That's what I was drawing. No, was really yeah, it was pretty. It, awesome. it freaked me out. <laughs> like literally freaked me out. They used like, a was... lot of cameras to like. Yeah, to, like, and. Take the picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the girl. A lot of cameras. Yeah, they actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They took cameras in like different parts of the earth, and then they made like a telescope out of it. It, it was crazy. And the yeah. girl, I think she's 26 or 27. So, like, she's super young and she got that, this crazy image nobody has ever got before. Like, Being a scientist, what? it would be real yeah. sick if something like that happened to me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, 
Uh, and actually, I just saw. Have you ever seen Interstellar? Yeah. Right. No. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay, uh, so basically, yeah, Einstein yeah. said that the closer you get to a black hole, the the different, the more different the time is for you, right? The closer you are for you for you an hour is like years for the people in the at the in the Earth, right? Like yeah. people far away from you. That in the in the Interstellar, that's the thing. It freaks me out. Like. <laughs> You basically get home and uh, you're old. You're younger than like your son. Oh yeah. It freaked out That's... Matthew McConaughey too. He was. Not happy about <laughs> yeah. <it>. Spoiler. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So Jacob, did you receive the third, the thing, the third word? Uh, when am I looking? Oh, on. The... Alrighty. Okay, Matteo, did you send the third word? Okay. Can I can I see it? Okay, okay, okay. Just put it there. Because I wrote them down, but I don't have the paper where it's written on, so I don't really know the answer right now. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm going down. Okay. Okay, so you... Okay, cool. You guys you guys ready? Yeah, oh, ready. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> oh, shit, I love this one. <laughs> I like your hat. Thanks. I wear it every day. It's disgusting. <laughs> Paper bag. It's a wabagong. Um, Arm. It's a it's carnivore a carpet. Nope. Burrito. Oh, yeah. Hey, well done. Burrito. It was you, John. Nice. I was going right. to color it. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, well done. Dick, we have to do something. I know my burritos, man. I didn't yep. get to be my size by accident. <laughs> The, the next one must be you, huh? You have to even the score. All right. I have half a point, so, though, don't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah sure, for sorry. hair <laughs> share. <laughs> hair share, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't think I forgot. So you <laughs> No, no, no. Okay, hold on. This is my word. Oh, come on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't remember it. Okay. I, I, uh, those are the hard ones. I picked them on purpose. Oh, uh, okay, cool. Uh, oh, yeah. I love the one. No, no, no. I think I got this. Uh... Come on, come on. Why is my pet? Oh, that's because I'm erasing. That's why nothing's actually coming up because I'm actually on eraser. Sorry, guys. Just make the background black and then you can draw with the eraser. That's true. Uh, Artist thoughts. Uh, yeah, if you if you keep it like that, I'm gonna give you another half point. <laughs> so you're gonna even the score. Girl. Yes, it's a girl. Oh yeah. Not, <laughs> so it's not got the that. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, dress. Swim. Oh, sundress. I love it. Swimsuit. I love it. Uh, it's ballerina. A... Ballerina. That's the one. No. Nope. Tutu. That... Tutu. Yeah. Tutu. Ah. Oh, with 1.5? Yeah. Nick is in the lead. I told you I've been practicing. <laughs> Had a training montage so... and everything. Ran up a bunch of stairs with some shadow boxing. In a tutu? That's a press. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Same reason why Nick, you wear those your... masks. <laughs> So, Dick, did you get oh, the word? No, I'm checking it now. Okay. Oh, the, oh, this one is pretty. Oh, pretty okay. Cool. Y'all ready for this? Nope. Yeah. But you're doing it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's a light hole. Um. Sun. Star. Sunburn. The oh my god! What? The, really? What? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you must even try. Wow. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry. Well done. Well done. We're so smart. In France they say chapeau. <laughs> Such a good artist. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, that's that's that was very good. Jacob, that's your turn. Your turn. Yes. And. Uh, did you yeah send the word to Jacob? Uh, did you get it? Yes, but I'm unsure right. of the word. I can. Oh, just show it to me. I'll tell you what it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, okay. I'll I'll I, I can do this. I can do this. Uh huh? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's okay. I don't need to know it. Okay. Okay, so I, I, this time I don't I don't understand the word. So I don't, I don't know it either, but not playing. Yeah, I'm, I, but I understand now. Okay, that's good because I don't. 
Nice. <laughs> 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 okay, yeah, I'm starting. It's a red line. No, that's a blue line. Oh. oh. Uh, cube? Nope. It's an upside down table. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, wrestling it. ring. Boxing ring. Oh my. No, 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 he's, he's correct. He's, uh, he's wrestling. <laughs> oh, so we're done? Okay. We're done. Oh, geez. <laughs> we're done. <laughs> well done, done John. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you, you could be like a, a challenge for it, my pant. He definitely could be. He won like super fast last time, but I guess we have a contender. Actually, this is a pretty good drawing. So, I like it, Jacob. Yeah, so, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Where are their legs? Is it like a wrestling ring hot tub? Is it underwater? <laughs> yeah, the, it's it's like a hot tub. <laughs> it's, it's mud wrestling. Yep. Why, why, the... <laughs> so, with three points, John goes first. With one and a half point, hair chair. Dick goes second. Dick hair chair. And Jacob, la creator. last but not least, how <laughs> was the third with one point? <laughs> yeah, this is so you make it bronze. Hey, that's bronze, bronze man. That's, 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 that's not bad. That's not bad. Silver's the best metal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, we don't have much time left, and uh, when I, oh, there's a question I really need to ask because. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna go with that question. So, uh, okay, I'm Italian, guys. If you if you didn't notice the accent, I'm actually yeah. Italian. And you know, you know, pizza is an issue there. Like, <laughs> it's a real big problem. Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> like we, we I know exactly. We exported a few ask. things and like we exported a few things and, and pizza is an issue. And I must say, I discovered here in France a pizza that like I love. And the question is, do you put? Or do you don't do not put pineapple on pizza? Yes. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Jacob. Uh, no. <laughs> I, lo I love pineapple. You... Pineapple on pizza is. Somebody put somebody put, yeah, yeah. Somebody is it, is put pineapple really on a pizza in my house. I'm kicking them out. That's that's just how it is. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, my hospitality yeah. only goes so far. <laughs> it's fantastic. Yes. Uh, is it? Anyway, the, this the, the the secret top tier ingredient though is garlic. Put garlic on your pizza, it's amazing. Well, okay, oh God, sure. No. Like the secret yeah, top tier ingredient of everything yeah. is water. But you what? just put garlic in everything. <laughs> I'm a, I, I don't know about, about you guys, but I've uh, there's not a whole lot of places near me that will put garlic on a pizza, and it's delicious. I never, I never try. It. I don't, don't really garlic. Yeah. <laughs> nah. I just, I just go with pineapple and yeah. With pork. Yeah. I've had, I mean, it's just not, not garlic. I've had onion on pizza. That's good. Yeah, yeah, onion, onion, they're crazy. Like onion and pizza, they're crazy. Mm -hmm. So two out of three, actually, pineapple. Is so good. it's subtle. Yes. Everyone likes pineapple. I, yeah, I'm, <laughs> like, I'm the weirdo. <laughs> from... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You definitely are this time. <laughs> <laughs> from which part of the America are you from, Dick? Wisconsin. Okay, so uh, I'm. Yeah. I'm like an animal in geography. Like I don't know. It's I think, uh, so... it's it's by those lakes right in the middle and. Uh, Oh, it's yeah, the, the native culture there is alcoholism. Eat a lot of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, can you can you get a picture? It's like consider East Coast or West it's Coast. It's right in the middle. <laughs> so, no shit, yeah. it's like it's, it's there. right in the middle, just south of the Canadian border. So it's it's fairly north. It gets pretty cold. Yeah. All right, all right. So uh, okay, I I I think it's not like a very big issue with like web comics fans. But I, I like, I enjoy NBA. Do you guys follow some? No. I have a lot of magic. Time. Magic I, is the closest I get to a sport. I, <laughs> but it, it was, it was I feel pretty... like I only watch enough to be able to talk with coworkers about it because they're pretty big into it, but not really. I, I'm not the scientist of the NBA. I just hope Toronto are going to win the, the Good series. Good deal. I just, I'm, I'm so tired of Golden State Line. <laughs> It's like Juventus in Italy. Everybody wants them right. to lose. They always win. Well, yeah. Like, fuck <laughs> we got... So I was a New York Yankee. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was a New York Yankees fan back in like the the '90s and the 2000s, and everybody in baseball wanted to hate them too. But the same reason that like everybody's rooting against Golden State right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they, they right. always win. Like, oh, come on, man. It's a game. Sometimes you lose. <laughs> mm. Okay, so the second biggest question before we before I'll, I'll let you go. Is do you have projects 
or some new stuff coming up. I want to and Jacob is smiling, yeah. so I want to know yeah, from you uh, first. I'm actually, I want to yeah, know some. Uh, me and a friend have been working on uh, a Sonic animation for several weeks now. Uh, kind of like uh, building on the trailer thing, uh, but we're doing it like completely new. So it's the premise is Sonic is doing cocaine. <laughs> and yeah so yeah that's the premise and uh yeah it's going to be really, really fun we're really close it's actually for school uh i don't know if the teachers are going to like it though because yeah it's cocaine I, and I don't swearing, know. But... i have a feeling okay. cocaine yeah. helps you study so, yeah you, just, you stay Gotta awake you're more energetic yeah <laughs> it directly taps into the dopamine system it makes you love things exactly like homework love right them now that's how um, I got through high school. Yeah. <laughs> now I have no septum at all left, but whatever. Oh, by the way, uh, Ray, uh, Jacob, I love your comic. Fuck the Thank pants. you. It wasn't drawn like, by me. It's a collaboration. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a yeah, collaboration. Yeah. It was like... uh, drawn by uh, Tinker Tanner. He's really great. I love his face, facial expressions. They're so good. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but it, it was written by me though. But yeah, he's really talented. Why? Sorry, they, they just told me something. And what about you, Dave? Other projects? Up, coming uh, project. I mean, outside of my job, that keeps me pretty busy. I do have another webcomic, but um, it's a very experimental, you, so I'm not telling you. You've seen the making? It. No, like... it's out. I have it on Instagram if you can find it. But that was <laughs> oh, 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 oh. a secret exactly. webcomic. So, so uh, it's public, but you're not saying right. where it is. Am I yeah, right? But I do have like okay. 500 followers, so. Now we just gotta scroll through the follower lists. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna stalk your Find page, it. I think. Yeah. <laughs> so, and what do you wanna do with this comic? Are you, are you planning to publish it sometime? CCI? Like some... I don't what, know. Some... I just when... draw fish I and I get sad, and then I make comics. So, <laughs> I don't have any big goals for it. If it goes somewhere, great. If it doesn't, then I'll just forget about it and move on with my life. Who knows? All right. All right. And what about you? I've uh, got a couple of collaborations going on right now. Those will be coming out in the not-too-distant future. Um, I guess the only other thing I'm trying to do, um, and i got to kind of get my butt uh, kind of in gear for that, is I want to start streaming more. So i got to get a computer to do that. Um, I've got to... Oh, you want to start streaming like a... Like, like, a, like I have a Twitch uh, account, but like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like a comic yeah. artist or like a, as a uh, gamer? A little bit of both. You know, obviously... I, it, okay. The way I see it, I'm, I'm spending a lot of time drawing comics anyway, so why not just do it in front of, you know, a bunch of internet strangers? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, honestly, <laughs> I, de I definitely agree. Yeah, no, but that's so true. Like, you can get some money, you can, you know, get some audience out of that, and you just do the same thing exactly. you do alone. It's like I do nothing different, except now I have a chat that gets to harass me, you know, here mm -hmm. all along the way. It's great. Yay! Yeah, it's really cool. There's been a lot of cartoonists recently that have, that have streamed, like yeah. Eat My Paint and Extra Fabulous. It's really cool. Eat My yeah. Paint? Eat My Paint? Uh, <laughs> Eat My yeah, Paint? Too. Dave Mercier, the guy that did Hop... Uh, Hop, Hop Dude, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm, yeah. Oh, yeah. But there's another oh, yeah, guy, like... I don't rem Instagram. Yeah, yeah, he does. That's he what? Yeah, he likes James. He does it live on Instagrams? Yeah. That's really cool, actually. But does it work? Seems to. Well, he's yeah, been doing it in a while, yeah. But Hop, Hop Dude oh, is ending now. Who's this guy? So. Yeah, but that guy's he's got several comics, and they're all great, so I'm yeah. sure he's doing it. But who's this guy? Sorry, I didn't, I didn't uh, know his name. Yeah, Mark Works. Dave Mercier. What? I could, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I, can, yeah. Can, I, I think I think I've read the name sometimes. Okay, so I, I want to ask you something, you know, some, something else before I let you go. And what about convention? Do you do you ever go to comic convention? I really, I, I would really love to go to one, but I haven't gone to none. Yeah. You've never gone to none like no, since now. No. None. Oh. All right. What I, about yeah, you? I've been to some since I've been big into superhero comics. So one of them, I got to talk to the writer of Flex Mentalo, which was like a big life-changing moment for me. But I haven't been to one since I started drawing TCI. All right. Um, Oh, TCI, I, I like the abbreviation. <laughs> Tree Climbing Corp. <laughs> it's a cool TCI, I do it, TCI, it's that's cool. <laughs> oh, that was pretty good. What so about I you, tabled Jim? one last year uh, at a very local, you yeah, tabled. A local convention, and oh, it was the first time okay. I did anything like this, so I can tell you exactly what I wouldn't do or what I would do differently <laughs> again. Um, I didn't it was get a nightmare. Of... No, 
it was actually a lot of fun, but I didn't get any, like, I don't think I got the value out of it that I could have, um, seeing kind of what a, a lot of other comic artists there were doing. Like, I didn't have any merchandise, so nobody was really at my booth, like, looking and, uh, and kind of kind of seeing what it is I had. So they are like, looking at it, I had a TV and was kind of showing my webcomic, and they'd look, they'd nod, and they'd move on, and that was kind of it. But so, like, yeah. it's fun. I would do it again. I just have to figure out when, now that I have a daughter. So y you weren't selling any no, book? No, no. I, it was just to, sh to show off, it, basically, to show I, your honestly, comic. I wanted to give it a try. It was it was something that was, like, 10 minutes All from right. my house. Um, you know, it was it relative. It wasn't small, but it wasn't like large either. So I knew it was, it was relatively low stakes. So I just kind of rolled the dice and see what it was all about. And like I said, I know what I would do yeah, so next time. Mm. Yeah, right. I'd love to have a table sometime. So... That'd be real cool. Yeah. But then I'd ha probably have to take a plane to London or somewhere. Yeah. London. Yeah, or like <laughs> America somewhere. <laughs> there are like one Comic Con here in Norway. Oh, there's a. We actually have been to a super big one in France. It's called Angoulême. It's actually pretty big in the world. It's like one of the biggest. Like the city is like no nowhere. Like don't go there if not for the Comic Con. <laughs> there's nothing. It's, it's boring as fuck. Trust me. But it, with the convention, <laughs> no, no. With the convention, it's like it's very good. Like it's super lively. The city center seems nice. So yeah. like, I mean, if you think about going to Europe to a Comic Con, that could be the first choice. Tiny century. little town full of nerds like, sounds great. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's not a super tiny. It's just there's nothing really. Like it's just a town with people hanging around. There's no it's much art, nothing. But there's just comics, so it's come. It becomes alive like four or five days per wow. year. Nice. That's very alive. Like people from all Europe goes oh. there. It's it's the biggest. Yeah, seriously. Le Bedes. <laughs> I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Bede, Bede. BD. But like, which is like yeah. comic. I have to say, uh, web comics is like BD numeric, mm -hmm. and numeric means uh, like yeah. electronic, you know. Oh. Yeah, they just yeah they have a weird way to translate things. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm learning French. I'm learning French. So guys, I I've asked you everything I wanted to to know about you, and I just want to thank you again for being here. I want to thank you all the people that like follow us this whole time. So. This is John, who's the creator of Alarmingly Bad. Check his comic, because he's very, very fun. Thank you. Dick, with Tree Climbing okay. Inc., which is a super cool comic, way deeper than I, what I thought. <laughs> and I really appreciate it. No, no, seriously. I'm really, and Jacob, who's like super young, super cool style, and is like doing very, very good, cool stuff, like day in day. Thank you. Like, it's got, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm really looking forward to see what you're going to be like some yeah. years, because I'm, mm. I'm really curious. So thank you guys and thank you all of you that follow us and have a good night. Yes, absolutely. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you everyone for watching. And yeah, yeah, yeah. It was really yeah. fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fun. So yeah. wait, wait, guys, wait, wait, wait. It was. It, it, <laughs> <laughs> it, it, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So,